Hey everyone, Jones Blues and Jam. This is a this is for my van um, video. Some of the things that I purchased. Okay, I'm trying to get that straight. Uh -oh. Okay. Hi. <laughs> anyway, for so uh, what I purchased at Walmart the other day was um, this stuff here. It's a glow in the dark room. And the reason I got this is because one, I want to be able to see where the door um, handles are when I'm inside, you know, so you can get to it quickly. I might even put a little bit on that um, floor where those hooks are at. But one of the main reason is I'm not able to see the keyhole when I'm trying when it's dark and I want to open the door and um, when I go out I just like I'm fumbling around I can't see you know so I figure maybe I'll put some of this on it and that'll help this is all prep okay and the main thing that I went to Walmart to get was uh, uh, it's in the car and it's big I can't bring it out but I also purchased a DVD I don't know how long it's gonna last is really cheap. I uh, go on the back of a headrest. And I got really that for my grandson so he can um he can watch his videos while I'm driving. Not that he's gonna be with me on the road as far as when I start to head out. But um why I pick him up because we're on the freeway on traffic forever, so this is what it looks like. And they were under a hundred bucks and you just put them on the back so I think I'll have to make some type of cover to cover this up why it's on um, on there not to uh, attract any attention and then you just open it right there she probably won't last and you put your DVD in I have one in there the one thing I'm that's worrying me is that the cord it's not that long it's really not that long so from and the cord goes down on the floor in the front and it's gonna have to go to the back don't know how that's gonna work so I'm gonna figure that out today I have to pick him up today I did call and he will be coming this today so that's a good thing um, I guess he has a three-day uh, weekend from nursery school i find it hilarious but you know kids need to stay busy um it would be nice if he could go with me before he start preschool and we can travel the world but his mom loves him way too much to do that so i get to get him on the weekend take what you can get right and be satisfied so that's one thing then to go into my um kit far as safety is these two stick lights right here and I don't know why but matches that don't uh, when they, they are waterproof matches okay little bitty stuff the main thing like I said is in the car and then I also purchased I got this here and I haven't opened it and I should have opened it and it seemed to have a little uh, hold on Okay, so I had to go get scissors. It's, so, um, and I did buy a can of butane. I've never dealt with this. I'm excited. I'm really excited. Um, like I said, I have no idea where I'm going. So, let's see. You get your manual in here. And, let me see. Now these were at Big Five, and they were more than what I paid for. This was under twenty dollars. When I had went to Big Five, it was ridiculous. It was like forty bucks they were asking for it. So this is where you put your um, your butane, close it up, um, and it just just a gas stove top. Hopefully, I never have to use it. Hopefully, I can use, if I do use it outside, hopefully, I could just use the, um, 
induction stove top, which probably will draw a lot of energy. I am going to go to the van because I need to get gas to go pick up my grandson. And then um, I'll show you what I purchased. And hopefully I can get this um, cabinet in here today. And once I get the cabinet in, then I just need to finish the bottom. I did purchase, you know, I'm so funny. I, I did purchase, and this is really funny. I purchased a, um, from the secondhand store. Hold on. Okay, I'm back now. This is funny, but, um, and I was serious. I bought this like two months ago. It is clean. I cleaned it with bleach like I do everything. And um, you guys know what that is. When you sit in a tub and... Um, take a shower a lot of older people use that well I, before I purchased it I measured out everything I don't know if I'm gonna have enough room for all this and here's the leg part here and you know guys know that dip that's in the back I really would like to use that as a shower area I mean I know you can't really um, take a big major shower but when I'm on the I want to be that's important to me is to be able to have a shower and to be clean and to be able to wash my face um, to have don't, don't, that's really important you know because it's, it's important <laughs> what can I say I mean you know I mean maybe no I'll, I'll probably I would probably never be the one that be not showering and this and that or anything it'll always be something going on because that's just um, no that, that that's not gonna work so anyway I bought that now you think I think I have a lot of room in here and when I'm not at the car and I'm thinking oh I can do this and I can do that and I can do that realizing that you really don't have that much room now if I did not have that seat in there which I have that seat in there for my grandson because you know you can't have kids in the front seat um, I would have more space, but I like that seat also because it's comfortable to sit in when you don't want to sit in the uh, front. You know, I wish I could turn it around. But anyway, I'm just going on. I'm going to go to the van. Excuse me. I had a hot dog. I know. I had a hamburger the other day. I had a big hot dog today. It was salty, but it was good. <laughs> uh, anyway. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to the car and I am going to show you my major purchase that the whole reason I went to Walmart. Okay, you guys, so I'm back inside. Um, really, you really need knee pads in here if you're going to be messing around on your knees. I'll put this down. And those are cushiony. So I have a blackout curtain here. That I purchased. This I purchased that a while back. Um, two packs. Here's the cabinet, and the cabinet is. You can see it's bolted right here. Um, I didn't know the seat could move up further. Um, But you know, you don't want to be sitting here and be totally uh, straight up. That would be uncomfortable. But anyway, we need to put this is what it looks like. And there's a bolt here in comparison to the window. So I need a bungee cord. You remember that? Um, and there's more space right there. I thought I could put my. I don't know how people do this. This is this is this is interesting, you guys. I mean, literally, when you are working or traveling in a van, you should not be in the van because there's just no space. There's no point. Okay, so I decided to put the cot up so you guys can see and so I can see. So you you know this is constantly was curved. Anyway, I had this here for my shoes and stuff, but I know I'm going to have to redo that. My plan was for this to go all the way back let me go around so that how that's how it looked right now I mean, you really couldn't open this up for anything let me see so 
Oh, you know, plans are made to be changed, huh? So, can't open that up. But you can easily, but you have, I have all this space here. Still. And I want this cabinet because I can put, you know, so many things in it. So it's not just out in the open, but it really is not a lot of space. Enough space under here. I just have to level that part off if I'm going to do it this way, then put uh, a flap over this 